day there, YouTube. So it's the best one day. I don't know why I say that. But then again, you know what? Sometimes maybe it is good to say it because you never know. There might be uh, someone that's watching this for the first time and they just never knew. Guy over there got pulled over for... Uh, he got pulled over... bringing a trailer onto the Taconic State Parkway. We're on the Taconic State Parkway going northbound right now. Beautiful day. It's it, This is the first day of autumn. And I figured I'd come out and take a nice, nice little ride down here and just enjoy this get in fifth gear and you can just cruise man people are like getting caught speeding like crazy holy crap now well, speed limit on here is 55 so I guess it's gotta stay within reason right anyway yeah so I figured I'd take a cruise up here and uh, have a little chat with you guys so the last two days, we uh, we did a yard sale, me and the kids, and you know the wife. Uh, there was a lot of stuff she wanted us to get rid of, figure out where we could put it, which was nowhere. But it all migrated down to the garage. It's a lot of old kids' toys, um, old kids' clothes, just stuff they've all grown out of that doesn't fit them anymore. And um, you know what? I was like, you know what? I'm tired of looking at this stuff. I need to make way in a garage. Um, we got a new fridge coming, and we're gonna put the old fridge. We're gonna put the old fridge downstairs in the garage. So you know, we just we, we needed the space. So I brought the tables out, set everything up, and made a few signs and put them out and we had a few people stop by you know I wasn't I, it's not like I was asking a lot of money for a lot of these things you know a lot of this stuff was I guess you could say I don't know pretty cheap you know we weren't asking you know a ton of money for a lot of this stuff so I sold I sold a good amount of stuff not a lot I'm not gonna say a lot. We'll just say a good amount. I think a good amount is fair. Let's just get in front of this car. But man, I tell you, the the you know the struggle of bringing all of that stuff out, lugging it all out, you know, doing other stuff around the house, uh, you know, just keeping a lookout, see if uh, you know anybody stopped by. Some people stopped by and sniff around and see if there was something they want and yeah, some people bought a few things but I don't know I you know what for me I kind of feel like I wouldn't have minded just to drop it all off at a Salvation Army give me a donation slip and I'll just I'll fill that sucker out and call it a day you know Fill it out and call it a day, man. Me and the kids can jump in the car and go find somewhere to go sightseeing. <laughs> but it is what it is. You know, like Viper 6 says, dropped off. Uh, I uh, packed all the stuff back in there. and I don't know. If the wife wants to log that stuff out, and try and sell it again. I packed it all in a van. That's on her. I'm not doing it again. The next stop for that stuff for me is the Salvation Army. And that's what I told her. I said, I'm not, I'm not picking that stuff up again, man. If you want to, you can go ahead. You can be my guest. But no thanks. So anyhow, that was my uh, Saturday and Sunday. And what I did, for the most part, aside from cutting grass and a few other things. So I hope you guys had a good weekend and everything was 
good with you all. We don't really have, uh, we don't have too many more nice weekends in Northeast. Uh, it's winding down, temperatures are winding down. But you can still get a few nice, nice rides in. So. I, I do like riding in Taconic North. It, it's nice. It's a two lane. I'm actually a little surprised it's this busy right now. That there's even this many people on here. Usually there's not this many people. And I'm running about 62 miles an hour right now. Which is a really nice cruising speed for this bike. I do a lot of my best cruising right around there. I don't really have a particular area that I'm going to or whatever the case may be. I'm just kind of just out for a ride and let the road take me where it needs to take me. Oh, I tell you, this wind feels so good. Just the way it's uh, just massaging me right now. It's really nice. You know, you think even with, you, you would think that, you know, having a fair in and all of this stuff that you probably wouldn't get a, a lot of wind, but you actually do. You get more than you actually think. Beautiful New York, guys. You gotta love it. Really gotta love it. I tell you, it was kind of nagging at me <laughs> it was kind of nagging at me to jump out and get out of there get out the house and take this ride I mean I spent my two days at the yard sale and my neighbor well he had some he had a little bit of trouble doing some doing the rear brakes on a Lincoln they got a Lincoln MKS so I was helping them with the uh, rear brakes on that. And that was interesting and weird all at one point, but we got it done. Um, ended up figuring out what that procedure or the best way of doing it, which we kind of learned the hard way. But they got, we got it done. We all got it done and got new rotors and pads on there and they needed a star tool. And luckily I had that star tool. <laughs> one of those uh, tools that I bought at a, at a Harbor Freight one day the star star uh, star key socket set and honestly I don't even know why I bought it because I don't I rarely ever used it maybe I bought it for the Buell but then even then that I'm not sure about could be or could not be I really don't know Anyway, uh, I'm going to continue with this cruise and I will talk to you guys a little later. You guys stay safe. Best 1-8 out. <laughs>